Yo, 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 it's Big Ant, the spokesman, man. We back, another edition of Urban Politicians TV, UPTV. Make sure you stay on your pivot at all times, man. Had to come tap in, and by the way it look online, little Baby and his team was planning on putting some snippets out today to get everything started and geared up to probably release a new single. He dropped one back in January, still doing numbers and things like that there. But when it comes to releasing these things, you're a mainstream artist. It's a lot going on in the media right now with Diddy and every other thing, with the stuff with Future and Drake and all that. You do got to put your promo out there across your timeline and everything. Well, when the snippet dropped, Academics posted it up. And as you can see right there, there's some glittery, shiny things on little baby fingers on the end of a part of this snippet and stuff like that. And he went into the caption and said, hey, yo, bros, my phone must be broke. Can y'all confirm to me this ain't 4 p.m. demon and prime minister little baby with the full set of painted nails? What's going on right now in Atlanta? And we've seen this as a thing with certain rappers, uh, Drake that did it. Back in the game, Young Thug did it and then came back and said, nah, he wasn't rocking with it no more from his, with his son. We seen Lil Yachty do it. We seen different artists in the game jump out there and paint their nails and engage in this type of activity and stuff. So the things with uh, academics, I'm pretty sure he probably was paid to post his music as well as part of the ad. And I'm going to tell you, they had their little past history online when Lil Baby dissed them in a song and stuff like that. Because he was coming on some, I don't even know what kicked it off, and then academics started going in and stuff like that. So there's already something there with them online. So then, what you call it, Lil Baby decided to go to his story himself and address everything and say, y'all blogs got to stop just posting anything. I ain't paying my mother effing nails. At this point, y'all got to see niggas like academics got an agenda. Miss me with that weird ish. No, LOL. And I'll keep it all the way a thousand with Lil Baby. The way that that image came off, whether it's the lighting, the editing, the way that the, 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 the angle hit, it looks like he does have almost a light white uh, something on his nails and everything. And that's just maybe the effects. But the way that he looked at his hand, it looked like that's what they was trying to push right there. Now, when academics jumped out there, and went with that caption, they most definitely caught the sarcasm and everything as well, plus with their prior history is why they did turn up and stuff like that. Now, I don't want to see niggas paint their nails. I stand firm on that at all times, bro. That ain't for me, and that ain't something that we supposed to be doing at all. Lil Baby say he ain't painting his, and I'm glad he said that. I do see why a nigga will think that, hey, bro, this nigga painting his nails now. What's going on and stuff? Because this looking away from the way this light is hitting right here. But little Baby said he ain't painting his, and I'm glad he is speaking out against that. Nigga, we are men. Leave that fingernail polish paint stuff to women, bro. Now, nah, we not going to play the game of what the emo stuff is with the black. You know what I'm saying? I do know some dudes be like, oh, I'm on that rock star time. I did this and this and this and that. And da -da -da -da. But come on, bro. We, if you ain't covered the game like that as a rapper, that wasn't what you was on when you came into this, bro. Because I ain't rocking with you. Just keep it in a thousand. But if you ain't covered this game like that as no rapper, don't get up in your career and start going crazy with it. Nah, Lil Baby still one of the top rappers in the game. We ain't got a project from him in a while. I will say this. You got to be active in niggas' faces in this game today. You got to keep dropping because if you don't, niggas will forget about it. This news cycle be crazy. Music cycle be crazy and stuff. Lil Baby still one of the top artists when he dropped. People going to tap in. His last tour was real successful that he had. Can he possibly go ahead and have that run like he did with the My Turn? I don't know, man. Hopefully so. Hey, hopefully they can get up in there, get active and drop some. But this one right here, even the timing of this, they probably already had a schedule to set. It's like, you know what? You don't predict the future news that's going to take over the internet and what's going to get all the attention. You don't get to, you know, decide that factor. But right now, it probably is like, man, it's kind of bad time because everybody is focused on the focus on the Diddy news and everybody is kind of focused on everything going on with uh, Metro Boom and Future 
and Drake and everybody else involved in that situation. But I ain't with the fingernail polish paint. Little baby say he ain't painting his, but that angle did give off that. Whatever going on with him and academics, that's between them. They're going to do what they do. Academics going to do what he do online and things of that nature. So they'll handle that how they have that little baby. Turn it up, dog. No fingernail polish. Please just stay off that. He denounced it himself right there. Tell me what y'all think. We got both videos. I'll let 1,000 for shit show.